I'm here with Dr. Romano to do an acid base problem. Hi, I'm Dr. Romano, professor of organic chemistry here at Romano Scientific, and I'd like to go over a problem with you dealing with acid and bases. A must have for the data exam is something known as the Henderson Hasselbalch equation. This is an equation in which we deal with buffers. When we create a buffer, we're going to use a weak acid or a weak base and its salt. So come around and let's have a look at how I'm going to be using a henderson hasselbach equation to do a problem. We have an unknown acid, we're going to call it HX, and the pKa is given as 6.1, and I ask you to find the ratio of the acid to its salt or its conjugate at a pH of 7.1. The minute you hear a problem that says ratio and you see you got the acid and its salt, I want you to think one word, and that's buffer. So what I'm going to do is I put up the henderson hasselbach equation, pH equals pKa plus the log of the salt over the acid. Now you got to be careful. We're asking you for the acid over the salt. So that's a trap. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply put in the values, pH is 7.1, pKa is 6.1, plus the log of the salt over the acid. Now, if this acid hypothetically was HF, this salt can be KF. So you get the idea what I mean by the X's. I'm going to subtract 6.1 from both sides, and I get 1 equals the log of X minus over HX. I take the anti-log of both sides, which gives me 10. 10 is the ratio of salt to acid. So therefore, the ratio of acid to salt would be the reciprocal of this, which is 1 over 10. So that means we're going to have one part acid and 10 parts as its conjugate. I hope this helps on how to use the henderson hasselbach equation. We have a lot of these questions in the Dat Destroyer. In our new edition, I wrote some more problems that will challenge the best of students. All right, I hope this gives you a good idea on how to use this equation. Good day to you.